next guy coming to the stage. His last name is Fraley, but he is never Fraley with me. <laughs> Everybody show some love for Nick Fraley. Let him know. Thank you, Shima. You know, Shima is my uh, long lost twin. You know, uh, she's a sister from another mister. You think she's hot? Huh? I'll give you another one. <laughs> She'll do you, man. She'll do you. All right, you guys are right. my type of crowd here, you know? People like to drink in the dark. You guys are all right. I like. Yeah, you guys are like trendy looking people, you know? Like, you guys look all fashionable. Like, look at this guy. You look like you, you know, shop at Brooklyn Industries or something, right? You know? You, right? You're doing good, right? I look like I jumped out of a J.C. Penny catalog. <laughs> doing it right. <laughs> No, I tell you, like, uh, New Yorkers, though, they take the most simplest things. Did you need to get by? Wait a minute. Did you need to get by? Okay, all right. That's all right. They can walk in front of me. It's okay. Yeah. <laughs> no, okay. Anyway, New Yorkers, we take the most simplest things, and, like, uh, you, you guys like it that much cooler. You know, like, for example, a simple thing like a backpack, right? New Yorkers, they don't wear a backpack. They wear a messenger bag. Right? I don't know, what's wrong with a backpack? I like looking like I'm in high school, you know? <laughs> or like a cup of coffee. You know, New Yorkers don't drink coffee, they drink Starbucks, you know? Oh, five dollars for a small, not, so, not too bad during a recession, huh? <laughs> and, uh, and also, you know, like jeans, a pair of jeans, right? New Yorkers don't wear jeans. They wear skinny jeans. Now, I don't know about you, I wear relaxed fit, okay? I like my balls. Okay? <laughs> skinny jeans. You know, one thing I hate about New York, though, is uh, roommates. You know, I never had a roommate when I lived upstate. That's right, I'm from upstate. You're probably wondering, like, how come he sounds like he's from a mafia movie? He's from upstate? Yeah, anyway, I'm lucky, I guess. I don't know. Anyway, anyway uh, I got a roommate, you know, and he's one of these roommates. He loves to have a conversation with me whenever he's wearing a towel, you know? He, like, comes out of the shower. He's like, yeah, you know, I was thinking... Gives me a little peek, you know. <laughs> what are you thinking that we should paint? I'm like, geez, you know, what did we just win a game? What are we, in, are we in a locker room? No, we're in the kitchen, all right? I'm having Captain Crunch. All right, go put some pants on. Uh, anyway, you gotta love Broadway, too. It's in New York. Broadway, right? You guys heard about that new Spider Man play? Yeah. Wow, Spider Man falls off the balcony, right? I mean, if you're a little kid, you always admire superheroes. You go to see Spider-Man. Hey, there's Spider-Man. Oh, oh, no, he just fell off the balcony. What the hell happened, you know? I said, I tell you, get, the, get, get, get a new actor, okay? Get Charlie Sheen to play Spider-Man. The guy won't, he, Charlie Sheen won't fall. He's permanently high. You know, hey, you know, let me help you out, man. You know, uh, weed is a performance-enhancing drug, you know? Do you guys know this? Yeah, if you guys are stoned, I'm a whole lot funny. <laughs> anyway, uh, speaking of being funny, you know, comedy, <laughs> comedy never gets me laid, man. Because comedy's not sexy, you know? But what's sexy? Music is sexy, right? So screw this the comedy night. We're going to make a karaoke night, huh? Listen, ladies. The summer wind came blowing in from across the sea. Huh, you getting wet? <laughs> <It's working? laughs> anyway, you know, I, I, I tell you, like, one thing that gets you laid, though, is a survey says money. Money gets you laid. And I don't have a 401k plan, so I'm a bit of a dry spell right now, you know? No, but uh, anyway, like, one thing about me, you got to, yeah, sure, I got a nice face, right? But that's the same adjective used to describe my penis, okay? Nice. Alright? Let me tell you something about what nice is, okay? Those macaroni picture frames you made in first grade, right? That was nice, right? Or you have sex in the morning. Hey, that's kind of nice, right? Yeah. But my dick is not nice, alright? I don't want my dick to be nice, alright? My dick is epic. <laughs> okay, when I die, my dick is going to be gilded and put in the Smithsonian. The families are going to come, they're going to say, hey son, look at that. That's a nice dick. <laughs> anyway, speaking of dicks, uh, I, got a new, I got a new invention for you, crowd. Single ladies, listen up. It's called PMS Caller ID, okay? Listen up, ladies. 
It's like midnight, right? On a Friday, I get a phone call from Jenny, you know? And she's like, hey, come on over. I'm like, oh, all right. Midnight, all right, we go all I go over. We start making out. And then she's like, stop. I'm like, stop, what, what? She goes, I'm on my period. I'm on your period? Why did you call me? Why did you call me? All right, it's midnight, all right? You, you know, uh, I, you know, I'm not here to cuddle with you and hear you blame me for your problems and watch Grey's Anatomy, all right? I tell you, you know, ladies, when you're on the crimson tide, don't call any guys, all right? It's not, it's not going to work out for you. All right, so you guys are going out getting drunk tonight, yeah, right? For this mic stands. <laughs> Who used this mic here? Uh, some midget or something? Many me? Anyway. <laughs> Anyway, uh, if you guys are going out and getting drunk tonight, uh, you know, I, there's, there's, let me fill you in, there's two kinds of drunk. There's drunk, you're going to get a slice of pizza late at night, you leave your ATM card at a bar, that's drunk, right? We've all been drunk before, right? But then there's white boy drunk, right? Guy comes out of the, the bathroom smelling like vomit, he's got his Yankees hat on, inside out, and he's damn proud of it too, he's like, ah, oh, I got the inside out of the Yankees hat! Right? And he starts talking to the bartender. He goes, yeah, she's hot. And you're like, dude, that's not a girl, man. And it's like, ah, oh, screw you, I got a number. Next thing you know, this guy's in the middle of Second Avenue trying to hail a cab with his pants, pants down, you know? That's white boy drunk. Or Thanksgiving at my house. All right. All right. Well, why don't you try to get drunk and laugh a little more next time for your next comic? Because this guy put it together. Put your hands together for the next guy. All right. That's it.